What's up everybody, I'm Abitage, and welcome back to Assault Android Cactus. It has been a while! Yes it has. And there's been a whole lot of updates and stuff since last time we played Zone 1 with Starch. And we're going to continue that, but first of all I just want to say that I haven't done any update videos and that sort of thing on this game because I have had very limited time, as you should be well aware by now. And I think update videos are only really relevant if they come out soon after an update, if you know what I mean. It's no point me doing one now telling you about what was updated about a month ago. Yeah? Dig? Cool. But check this out, we've got Infinity Drive and Boss Rush. Boss Rush is what you think, you just play through the bosses. Why you'd want to punish yourself like that, I don't know. <sighs> Infinity Drive is fucking cool, it's basically an endless mode. There's bosses in there as well, there's every type of enemy, that sort of thing. And there's new sounds and stuff, there's new graphics, there's different enemy types and that sort of thing. To the point when we hit start right now... Pineapple! She says pineapple. As you do. Pineapple! <laughs> so yeah, there's new... Um, there's art for justice, which we haven't seen before on this series anyway. Uh, there's new art, uh, enemies in this zone, I think, in the fourth zone. Maybe? Or it's the fifth? I can't remember. Venom is on its way and there's a new android on its way too, so let's just jump in and see if we can get this done with Starch. Now, I haven't been playing a whole lot of this recently. In fact, today I had some time and I thought, you know what, I'm going to check out this Infinity Drive business and the updated stuff. And you know what happened? It's freaking awesome. <laughs> forgotten how much fun this game could be, and Infinity Drive is a really good way to play. I kind of like the idea of a, a endless mode. Battery over here. And there's new voices and stuff, which is Pretty wings. like that. <laughs> Some of it can be a bit cheesy, but it's kind of cute and whatever. It kind the only worry I have about some of the audio is that it is a bit cheesy and. This uh, this game, as much as I, I really, really enjoy it and I like it and it's mechanically very, very fun to play, <laughs> it is walking that line of kind of comic animu cuteness crap, which isn't really to my taste. It's just a taste thing. It doesn't mean it's bad, but that's cool. Whatever. <laughs> <laughs> the mechanics are still solid, so that's that's all I really care about. And hey, at the end of the day, I'm a grumpy old bastard, so, you know, don't take my word for it. <laughs> you know what I'm like if you've been watching any of my stuff till now. I really should use this uh, secondary a lot more. I think that's a theme for me, isn't it? Use your secondary more. It would probably help. In some scenarios. Oop, not in that one. Although I find like a powered up weapon on especially these early levels, it's not, it's pretty good. You can basically just cut through whatever. And I'm not going for high score runs or anything at the moment, so. Hey. Battery here. Pretty wings again. <laughs> pretty wings again. Oh, so there's no announcer. Oh, although. I'm not. See, I'm not used to these voices. I'll try and turn up the audio on the game. I usually mix it pretty low when I'm com doing commentary as well. But in the in the next level, I'm going to shut up so you can hear it. But Everything's dead. now that they've all got their own voices, they've all got a bit more personality and a bit more unique things to say. And that was an S. Who would have thought? But I'll shut up for now so you can hear Starch exclaiming about level ups and that sort of thing. Stay. 
activated. Battery up. Weapon max. Look at circles. Battery over here. Circles! So you get the idea. So they've each got, dead. I think, full voice acting and stuff on them. That was another S. I'm pretty happy with that. Um, <laughs> yeah, they've, they've each got full voice acting on them, which is kind of nice now and adds more personality because I was playing Infinity Drive earlier with Holly, of course. Go Team Holly. And uh, one thing I didn't notice was voices and maybe that's just because I'm used to Holly's voice and maybe Holly's voice has been in a bit longer I'm not sure Pretty wings. so maybe that's the case or maybe I'm just a dumbass there's always that possibility in fact that's kind of a given but you get the idea and that's kind of cool it's kind of nice coming back to it after a bit of a break considering it is early access and is being updated and has been updated more the point And there's too many mines. Tiny robots, stay. Although things have gotten a little bit harder in my opinion. <laughs> Again, maybe, maybe that's just me, but it... Last update, or maybe this update, I can't remember which one, but it just felt like it got a whole lot harder. Which I'm okay with, because... You know, the early levels are still fairly easy and fairly straightforward. But the later levels just are atrocious these days. Atrocious in difficulty, not in, you know, quality. <laughs> like, yeah, it just feels really difficult. Not to mention Justice, who I just... I don't get justice. I can't understand what the hell you're meant to do with justice. Even after, you know, I, I read the dev logs and all that kind of thing because they're really interesting and I suggest anyone else check them out. I think you can get to them just over on witchbane.com. But anyway, they're really interesting and, you know, the process of designing and building and the way that the guys who make this do it is really interesting just as Everything's someone who's dead. into games but I don't get justice there was some explanation about justice that I read but I, I can't remember <laughs> I, it's kind of like I get the theory behind Vespula but I'm still no good at her <laughs> but I get the theory behind her I, I understand how to beat her I just find it difficult to beat her well I can still beat her and I can still beat justice I just don't understand them we, we, we have trouble connecting on a personal level. Oh, oh, oh. Frig. Gotta use secondary more. Always telling myself, gotta use that secondary more. Oh, oh that was a lucky dodge there. One thing I like about Starch is that focused laser's ability to take down towers, and I'm about to die. Holy crap, I better turtle up a little. Battery up. Pretty wings again. Not that I'm going for a knockdown free run, but I always try and do well. No, I'm not just 
fart asking around here. I'm trying to do well, even if it doesn't look like it. <laughs> oh. This is one game where I have been, you know, it's no secret I've been enjoying it as an early access game because every time there is an update, it's an update that has enough polish that it's kind of like refreshing the game every single time. So like just when you think you're getting used to every level, every boss, that sort of thing, it you get an update and it's like, oh, something else to check out. So yeah. I wish, I wish early access was always like this. <laughs> but that's a debate for another day. Let's get a shut down. No, we're gonna have to get five out. Or tiny robots, as Starch likes to call them. How cute. I'm interested to see what the others sound like now. Especially the ones that we're used to, like more Holly and Cactus and oh, another S. I'm totally surprised by the S's. I'm, I'm not expecting that at all. We won't get an S on Vespula. We'd be lucky to get a B, I think. I'm happy if I just beat Vespula. Blah, 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 blah. Establishing connection. Yeah, so like Vespula, I understand the theory. Like you, you attack the swarm. And that brings down her health and She's kind of got patterns that you can recognize. Like this, this is all kind of bullet hellish patterns. Jesus Christ. And if I knew what was going on more, I'd probably have a better chance of beating her. Why do I always stand right in front of those? Hey, if we can survive. I need that battery. This is one where they get thrown out at you, isn't it? Might have to time a secondary. Uh, maybe that's the third wave I'm thinking. Oh, there's a power up down there. Oh no, I'm on the wrong side of because the shit. <laughs> the wrong side of the business there. I'd like that battery. See if I can survive long enough to get there. Oh dear. I don't survive that, I'm gonna... Oh, ooh, very close. This is the one where they get sent after you. And I'm gonna die. Please don't die. Oh, shit. Ah. That was almost an inev inevitability. Hopefully that'll help us rip through them a bit quicker. Oh, shut down, please, please. Ah. Oh, I was too, too overzealous. I missed the shutdown and I had to get... The Five. God damn it. Paying attention to too many things at once. Oh my goodness. So like this, I'm confident that I'll be able to beat Vespula here. It's just not going to beat her very well, that's all. And I'm going to die a hell of a lot more before it happens too, probably. God damn it, I'm always going the wrong way. Yeah, yeah, yeah. You know, you can keep away from me as well, you know. I don't have to do all the keeping away. Oh shit, we may not beat her. Oh man. Come on, come on, come on, come on, come on. She's got this nothing left. There we go. Oof. Blah, 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 blah. Everything's dead. Everything's dead. Yep, and it's a D. <laughs> anyway, that'll do us for Zone 2. Thank you so much for watching. We're going to head on into zone 3 and see hopefully some new enemies, maybe some new art, that sort of thing. There's definitely new art on Justice since last time we looked. But yeah. Thanks for watching. Goodbye.